matrix multiplication let a is equal to a i j and b is equal to b i j b any two matrices these two matrices can be multiplied if and only if the number of columns in the matrix A is equal to the number of rows in the matrix B. That is, if A is a matrix of order M cross P and B is a matrix of order P cross N, then these two matrices can be multiplied as the number of columns in the matrix A is equal to number of rows in the matrix B. Then their product matrix AB will be of order M by N. Let's now proceed with an example. If A is equal to 2, 2, 5, 5, 3, minus 1 and B is equal to 4, 7, 2, 5, 3, minus 2, find the product AB. So before multiplying, let's verify the condition. Here, A is a matrix of order 2 by 3. That is, it has 2 rows and 3 columns. And B is a matrix of order 3 into 2. That is, B is a matrix consisting of 3 rows and 2 columns. Here, the number of columns in the matrix A is equal to number of rows in the matrix B. Therefore, these two matrices can be multiplied. Let's now proceed with the solution. First write A into B, A matrix and matrix B and these numbers denote the elements A11 A11 is the element in the first row first column A12 denotes the element in the first row second column A13 denotes the element in first row third column similarly A21 denotes element in the second row first column A22 denotes element in second row second column and A23 denotes second row third column element. Similarly B11 denotes the element in first row first column in the B matrix. Then B12 denotes the element in first row second column. Similarly we have B21, B22, B31 and B32. Let's now multiply these two matrices. First step is to consider the first row and multiply with the elements in the first column. Consider the first row with the first column. Let's now multiply these two. Now we have Two, first row first element first row first column element is 2 so we get 2 into 4 plus first row second column element gets multiplied with second row first column element 2 into 2 plus 5 
into 3. So we have taken first row multiplied with all the elements in the first column. Let's now proceed with first row and second column. First row multiply with second column. Therefore we get 2 into 7. That is A11 gets multiplied with B12 plus second element 2 into 5 plus third element 5 into minus 2. Similarly, let's now proceed with the second row and first column. Second row element should get multiplied with the first column. Therefore, we get 5 into 4. That is A21 into B11 plus 3 into 2 plus minus 1 into 3. Let's now proceed with second row and second column. Therefore, we get 5 into 7. That is A21 into B12. Next element will be 3 into 5. A22 into B22. Plus minus 1. A23 is minus 1 into B32 is again minus 2. Let's simplify. We get 8 plus 4 plus 15. Here we get 14 plus 10, 5 into minus 2 plus minus 10. The second row we have 20 plus 6 minus 3. And finally we have 35 plus 15 minus 1 into minus 2 will give you plus 2. So, when we simplify, we get this one, which is 27, 14, second row, 23, and 52. So, we see that the product matrix AB is of order 2 by 2.